What's up? This is Willie, aka Unofficial Ninja, and I'm back with another. Is this real life? And this time, once again, it's another um, Dear White People. This is uh, part three. And like I said, this isn't meant to offend anybody. I'm just recanting, uh, recounting some of the actual things that have happened to me in my everyday life. These are all 100% true. I just put it out there because I wonder has anyone else experienced this stuff? Because to me it's extremely weird and all my friends say I'm the only one it ever happens to. Uh, I think a year or so ago, probably about a year ago, um, one of our universities here in Oklahoma, the OU, so Oklahoma University, there was a, a tape that came out showing I believe it was a football team um, or a white sorority or fraternity chanting um, a chant that was very racially insensitive and had a lot of uh, inappropriate word usage and was very racist and so when that came out it was like a big controversy and everything about it um, and actually I didn't even find out about it till probably um, three or four days after it already happened I'm sitting there in the grocery store and I'm using the self checkout and there's an older man probably in his uh, late 50s early 60s in front of me and um, I just noticed he kept looking back at me and then looking away when they were kind of like look he would, like look away and then he like look back at me and then he look away again I'm just on my phone and I'm like thinking in my head why are you staring at me dude this is creepy you, you, do you want something from me and then out of nowhere he just finally turns and he's like <sighs> it's I hope you didn't see those tapes not a hi or what's up or anything like that his first words were to turn to me sigh and say I sure hope you didn't see those tapes and I'm like thinking what tapes and I deep down I knew what tapes you were talking about but I'm like please I'm in a grocery store you don't know me please and he's like yeah those uh that OU tape he's like that ain't right that's not what the Lord would want from us that's just no that's I can't believe they would do that and I'm so sorry sir and I just hope you haven't seen those tapes and I was thinking uh, okay first off why are you apologizing you weren't you weren't in these tapes just because you're white and they were white you don't have to take the blame for them so no you don't know me and I, you, I'm not even showing that on this set a set or anything to where you would even think to bring this up with me. I'm sitting here listening to my music. I'm sitting here listening to Japanese music, so I'm probably one of the least ja uh, black persons you'll ever meet in terms of like, my card has been taken away several times. It was so weird, I'm like, why are you, why? And so, I just, my mind is just blown at this point. And he's like, yeah, this is, um, they're gonna have to answer, answer to God on that one. Then he just shook my hand and said I'm so sorry got his groceries and walked away and left me there to finish checking out my my uh, groceries so yeah dear white people no I'm checking out my groceries I don't need to answer questions about racist stuff you don't have to represent a whole culture I don't represent a whole culture grocery shorts is not the place for us to have this conversation and it's so bizarre and weird for you to do this. Just don't. <laughs> That's that story. I have a lot more of these uh, types of stories. Um, like I said, not all of them are about white people and their interactions with me. Most of them are, but there are some coming that are just regular weird things that have happened. It's just weird that mostly 90-95% do involve white people. And it's pretty much my fault for being so damn cuddly and uh, approachable. It's all my fault. Anyway, so if you like what you saw, hit the like button, share with your friends, check out our other um, accounts and stuff below in the links like Twitter, uh, Twitch, Facebook, all that. And um, leave comments about what you think. Has this type of stuff happened to you before or am I alone in these situations? So, once again, this is another episode of Is This Real Life? Until next time.